Hey guys, it's Michelle from Chopticon. Today we are here with the rest of Best U with some tips and tricks to help you navigate and understand Schoology better. Here is Sophia and Sophie. Hi guys, it's Sophia from Chopticon. And Sophie from Great Mills. And I know this year, Sophie, the bell schedule really had me messed up. Like I didn't know when my classes started or when I needed to be on live. So what I did to fix that problem was I put alarms on my phone about three minutes before each class started. This way, I actually had time to get ready and prepared before my meet. What other things did you do to help you this school year? Well, I found that making sure that I don't sleep in and eating a good breakfast has really helped me. And also, keeping all of my class codes right next to my computer in my agenda so that I'm able to get to all my classes on time. Yeah, a planner really helps me. Like, I can put all my assignments that are due that day or what I have coming up or homework even, and I have it all in one place that's easy and readily available. So I guess now we give it over to Nagina and Daniel who are going to help you use your technology to your advantage this school year. Hi, I'm Daniel from Great Mills. And I'm Nagina from Leonardtown. And we're going to show you some tips about technology. So first, I know a lot of people are getting really tired of the blue light from their screen and it hurts to stare at it all day. One thing you can do is go down here, type in nightlight, and you can adjust the amount of blue light being emitted from your screen. Do you have any other tips, Nagina? Yeah, when you're in a Google Meet and you want to see some more of your classmates, you can click at the bottom right-hand corner on these three little dots and click Change Layout. And you can choose from all these different layouts. This one gets you up to 16 different classmates on your screen. But what do we do with all those emails that we keep getting? Well, one thing you can do is go into Schoology. And if you tap on your name, and then tap Settings, and then Notifications, you can adjust what emails are going to your inbox. And it's always a good idea to clear your cache every couple of days. You can go to the top right hand corner, click these three little dots, go to History, Clear Browsing Data, and you can clear your cache. Those are all the tips we have for you today. Let's take it back to Michelle. Thank you all for watching. If you want more tips and tricks on how to be your best you, make sure to like and subscribe for the next video.